Millions of Americans take the day off to celebrate Martin Luther King Jr. Day. Many Utahns are coming together all across the state to amplify the message Dr. King shared decades ago. Yes, ABC 4's reporter Kate Garner joining us to give us a look at a few of those messages, Kate. So let's stand together, let's fight together, and we can make those wrongs right. 40 years ago, President Ronald Reagan signed Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. Day into law as a federal holiday, 15 years after Dr. King's assassination. Today, Utahns are still fighting to realize Dr. King's dream. So it's important that we are working on housing, education, employment, criminal justice systems. That work is still relevant, important, and not to do it is impacting families and communities in a negative way. Ogden NAACP President Betty Sawyer is one of many taking time out of her day to remember Dr. King and spread a message of equality. And to respect each other. We're all human beings. We all bleed red. We all bleed red. A message of self-awareness. You know, we may not be able to change everything, but we can at least change ourselves and change starts with you. A message of representative government. We live together, we work together, and in order for us to, you know, enact laws that are going to help all of us, we have to do that together. A message of unity. We're better together, but we actually need to do that. Do better, live better, be better, and we can do that. You know, each of us has an opportunity every day to really choose love over hate. And a message of human connection. Small acts of kindness, little, little random acts of kindness is really what we're trying to get people to consider. And not only that, but obviously the big opportunities as well. And so as we do these marches, we reconnect with people, we invite them to sit down with us and to work with us, and that's why we have to continue to celebrate and commemorate. If you didn't get a chance to celebrate today, the University of Utah is hosting events all week long to commemorate and further the legacy of Dr. King. For more information, visit our website at abc4.com. Reporting in Salt Lake City, Kate Garner, ABC4 News.